So hi everyone. Many of you asked about creating different columns in Wix and for a while it was quite a chore to do so because you had to manually either put in tables or text boxes side by side. But I just saw that Wix has changed their setup and added a feature so that you can do just that. And what I'd like to do with this video is to show everybody how to do it because it's very, very easy and get it out to you as soon as possible because it probably will change your design. So what you want to do is go over to add, click on it, and basically uh, scroll down until you get to this thing called strips. Okay, and once you, you scroll down to the sh strips here, there's a bunch of different things. And what this is going to do is it's going to put actually a strip across uh, your, your page. And you can choose to put, you know, like a strip with background. I'm just going to put a plain white strip uh, across the page and probably move it up here as I save the space for it. Go up here. But like everything else, see this this is already saying change strip background. And that's what you're gonna want to do. Do that. Like if you click on this See, it already has different backgrounds that that you could choose here, and almost positively certain that you can also yes, right up here you could change the color. So we could we could go in and basically you know color this as we would like to, probably pretty close to what we have there, or you know actually go ahead and you know, get it even closer. But anyway, what we want to do for columns is to go here and click on layouts. And right there it is. It says add column. Okay. And what that'll do is it'll add a column. You can add up to five of them across here. You can also align the content as you wish. You can, once you add it. So here I am. I just added it. Okay. And there's the content. And if you click on manage column, uh, see it, it asks which one, because okay? now that I added one, I have two columns. And you can basically go, you can duplicate them. You know, you can, you can move them around. Okay, so I just moved it over. And you can trash it. Okay. And also stretch columns. Okay. Over here, you can also mess around with the alignment and everything else that you would do, including I think there's there's places in here. I haven't played around with it enough, but uh, supposedly you can you can mess around with you know like the border space and all that stuff. Anyway, so if you would like to, this is the way. Um, oh yeah, look at that. There's the, there it is. There's the, the layout. There's the column spacing. There's the padding. And so you can, you can choose what padding is between, you know, the columns. You can, you can like stretch the text and make text. This is how you can, you can like determine, you know, like make it like a two column newspaper thing or something like that. Those kind of layouts. And like I said, you're supposed to be able to do up to five across. So this looks like it's pretty handy and you can you can naturally like expand it or contract it. So there's a lot of different things that you can do with this feature.